pleasure to say that today, due to all of your hard efforts, our efforts across the state, across the country, in one day of calling, we made 54,000 calls! Yeah. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> yes, all of you were done by hand lists. I have no idea how much you did, we'll figure it out. <laughs> I would say 55,000, maybe 56 even at least. Thank you all so much. Thank wait, you. We're going to wait, wait a little while for the results. Clean up a little bit. Then head over to the party. Yeah. I thought you guys were excited about that. Because when I say party, I get louder results. Can we try it again? Yeah! yeah. yeah. Woo! Let the cannabis out of the bag! I think we're all exhausted. I'm Chris Conrad with my wife, Mickey Norris. We've been working on this for 22 years, and 20 of those years has been with Richard Lee. What can I say? That there's a man who has shown the dedication and the courage of his conviction, and the one who can put money where his mouth is, that was a rare commodity on this planet. This guy has everything to downstairs in the parking lot by countless thousands or hundreds of thousands that want to know what we have to say. And first and foremost, thank you, California, for a healthy debate. We appreciate uh, the tremendous victory in pushing this issue forward. In fact, yes, give yourselves a round of applause. We've taken this issue further than anyone ever has. Congratulations to you all. And we look forward to continuing this discussion. We've already had consensus amongst our opposition that current policy has failed. And it's just a matter of taking the next step forward. We've already started working with elected officials and had great conversations. We have a coalition that is bar none the best ever built. And we're planning on meeting with a coalition of our opposition to take the next step here at the end of January. We already have the plan in place. So we finally got what we need to get the engine started. We're not kicking off from zero anymore, folks. We are on the freeway. We are mainstream. We have made this happen. Yeah. 
you have made this happen. This is the debate heard around the world, and I would like to introduce the man that started the conversation, Mr. Richard Lee. Thank you. We won tonight, we won for the last six months, the last year, all the years we've been fighting. Uh, we're gonna keep fighting. Uh, we've made such great breakthroughs with this campaign and the, uh, the biggest breakthrough is all the uh, allies we've gotten on board, the people on the stage here behind me. Um, it's really been um, amazing, the support we've gotten. Uh, first of all, I have to uh, start with uh, Dan Rush, and the UFC W number five United Food commercial workers. These guys got on board last Christmas. Law enforcement against prohibition. These guys been right there with us. The uh, Drug Policy Alliance, Stephen Gutwillig and Ethan Nadelman. But then, then this summer we had the volunteers come on board and it's really been amazing to see those guys come every day, make the phone calls. Uh, James is here, uh, headed him up. And uh, next guy, we, uh, we, quickly, we quickly named him Super Dave because uh, the thousands of calls he made. Him and uh, about six other volunteers they really uh, showed you what it's all about, and that's why we're going to win, is because of that energy. You know, they're the future, they're, they're the ones who are going to be, keep fighting. Um, yeah, but it's, I'm really, uh, you know, it's amazing. Um, Perry, up here with the uh, online. You should get up here, Perry. How are you not doing up here? Get up here. How about uh, Mauricio, the uh, campaign manager? And uh, how could I forget uh, people who I've been working with for uh, like 20 years, Chris and Mickey, Chris Conrad, Mickey Miller. Yeah. Yeah. Then I saved the last two. Um, guy I've been uh, working with here in Oakland. I first met him in 1995. I was gonna move to San Francisco, but then I met uh, Jeff and, and found out what he was doing with the OCBC. Uh, Jeff Jones, everybody. My uh, co-proponent. And uh, his beautiful wife, Hale, who's been a great spokesperson, you already heard from. And uh, last but not least, all the uh, uh, soldiers from uh, Bulldog Company, people I've been, uh, had the honor to lead into battle for the last 10 years. Uh, they're the ones who uh, did the, uh, the work over the years that, that really made it possible for us to get on the ballot so that these guys could do all the great work on the campaign and to build toward the, uh, the next victory. So thanks again, everybody, for all the uh, support. And we're on it together, and we're going to win. So thanks again. A couple more I forgot. So many people to thank. It's like the Oscars or something. Now they're going to turn the music up on me. Um, Alan St. Pierre, you should be up here with Normal. All the work Normal's done for all the years. And then, of course, how could I forget? Uh, we not, none of us would be here. I wouldn't be here without uh, my parents. Uh, my mom and dad are here. Come on. Come on. You want to say a quick
quick word, Mom? To say we are proud of Bridget is such a small thing to say. I've worked in politics all my life, but I've never had a campaign that I think means as much to the whole world as this one does. And I just... got to put an end to the racism that's ex that has come about with the drug war. Yes. Amen. And my, my mission now is that if the Republicans that I have supported really believe in cutting spending, they need to do it with the funds for the war on drugs. <laughs> Richard has two parents, and here's his other one. Well, first, let me start by just saying what a fantastic, what an awesome uh, event it is. It has been for the last couple of weeks that I've been out here to see this crew, this, uh, this organization, just make things happen magically there at, uh, at the campaign headquarters. No direction, uh, no, nobody barking at them, nobody telling them uh, how to do things. It, it just, they just took over and automatically made them uh, uh, happen to make, make things go. And they were good to us uh, as novices, as people uh, that uh, don't know as much about computers or don't know as much about campaigning, don't know uh, exactly uh, what California is like, but 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 they made us feel welcome and made some uh, made us uh, really really understand more than we thought we would. But you know the the bigger picture on this and the, uh, beyond beyond what happens in this state, beyond what happens in this country, is is being filmed hundreds of times by people making uh, documentaries from all over the world and to, to be there at headquarters when these people from Sweden, from Germany, from Spain, from Mexico come in and, and they want an interview, they want a picture, they want to know more about what this, what this uh, campaign is really about. So uh, I, I, think, I think all of you have started something that uh, maybe Ann and I will not see the end of, but I'm convinced that uh, it, it's going to change, not the country, but the world. Thank you. Thank you.